Stanford University operates a state-of-the-art central energy facility, utilizing district-level heat recovery as the primary technology. Stanford's innovative design combines the heat recovery system with thermal energy storage and renewable energy to operate the facility. Equipped with large-scale, high-efficiency heat recovery chillers, the central energy facility captures available heat from the chilled water system and stores or repurposes it to generate hot water for campus heating. To maximize the benefits of the new plant and distribution system, the facility is managed by an automated software from Johnson Controls, Central Plant Optimization, or CPO. CPO is an industry-first model predictive control software application. It monitors more than 1,200 critical variables in near real time and predictively optimizes plant costs. The algorithm is continuously repeated and considers factors like current loads and operating conditions, campus activities, building occupancy, ambient environment and utility rates. It also considers projected market energy prices, the seven-day weather forecast, and equipment conditions and availability. A key element of Stanford's Central Energy Facility's design are the thermal energy storage tanks. 10 million gallons of cold water and 2.5 million gallons of hot water are stored in the three tanks. The tanks enhance the benefits of the heat recovery system by allowing the heat recovery chillers to operate when grid electricity prices are the lowest. The software simplifies plant operations by automating tasks and controlling routine responsibilities. Almost 500 different control decisions are generated to ensure the system is operating efficiently. CPO takes a systems approach to district-level efficiency management, revolutionizing the way companies, cities, and campuses across the country and around the globe address their heating and cooling needs. Learn more about the latest in central plant optimization at www.johnsoncontrols.com digital.